Operation Sindur also showcased India's tech-powered military strength, from neutralizing Chinese and Turkish origin drones to striking Pakistani targets with loitering munitions. India used only indigenous systems. Akash missiles, IACCS network and loitering drones worked in perfect sync. No Indian asset was lost. This reflects success uh, of uh, years of local R&D, PLI schemes, industry growth. With over 550 drone firms, Indian defense export crossed the record figure of about 24,000 crores in uh, the year fi uh, financial year 2024-25. And now India is eyeing a 50,000 crore defense export by 2029. Atmanirbhar Bharat has proved its firepower clearly. So even while attacking, uh, you know, the enemy Ajay, uh, there were, of course, a lot of indigenous uh, weapons and uh, drones used as well. Uh, obviously, this is now likely to be showcased to the world and perhaps our defense exports will rise because of this. Yes, it is expected that uh, uh, I remember that earlier when uh, this uh, play, you know, this was planned that uh, India will be a defense, uh, you know, exporting hub. Uh, then there was a number of people, those who were in the opposition, they were raising, uh, you know, question that uh, what they are going to do, they are going to hand over the defense sector to the private sector. Uh, and there was a number of questions. But uh, when this uh, situation arises and our uh, indigenous system have worked, whether it is a, a car, uh, you know, uh, Akash missile and the anti-drone system and other things which they have uh, used during this situation that have shown that how important decision it was and uh, now after uh, the, the, the after the uh, response after the results uh, this is going to boost the Indian defense sector in the other countries as well and uh, the way basically uh, uh, this has given a result it is going to other convince other countries as well to come and have these uh, you know uh, product from uh, India and especially in the defense sector we know that uh, the situation which is going on all over the world uh, everyone needs such system which can protect their people and uh, the defense sector uh, defense installation as well so that's why it is expected that uh, during 2024 and 25 uh, you know which was at 24 to uh, 24 thousand crore uh, export uh, it is going to uh, you know enhance and India eyeing on uh, 50,000 crore defense export by 2029. So this is also going to boost the Indian economy and also going to take India on the next level.